welcome to this vlog how are you guys i hope everyone's okay i'm at my parents house it's like is it noon already it's almost noon and i've just come from vipingo i'm heading to nyali to do the shopping my little house shopping food shopping not much just picking up things that i need yeah so let's go and then we're gonna head back home <music> shopping now you can see my bags there in the back there's a bunch of stuff can you see uh, yeah I'm heading over to the other supermarket is it um, quick mart to check for other stuff I didn't get here and also to check for more promos and then I'm gonna head to the bingo Bye. Please don't tell me this is the last one. No. This is new. I'm that same one for all the skis. In the bed, I'll get gosh off and look at the man coming and making my tea. But the minutes I lift from the post, I think I'll see him. Let's talk over tea. These days, it's all about blessing. Talk about bonds when I make this beat. I got this from the boat, and Kelly telling me, sit tight, gonna make me a beat. In a cat for the stylish, babe, when a stylish beat, trying to make me a treat. Trying to talk about rovers, it's all fucking affect this beat. Two sets, let me take this call, cause I'm even soon trying to pack this chain. Spin all the teenagers, bit fucked in the bed, trying to get big checks and the cash flow speed. Look at my boys in the block. I always need help to carry 
my bags to the house because first of all I live on fourth floor and yeah I have scoliosis bitch <laughs> so I can't be doing too much heavy stuff yeah 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 that's why swimming works for me more than like going to the gym lifting weights swimming also gets my muscles kind of toned so See you inside the house. vloggers do <laughs> so you can see everything that I got it's mostly food stuff a lot of food stuff just topping up basically <laughs> The only Malteser that I found. I'm so sad. I only got one. Okay. I had also packed some pilau from my parents' house. I always, always get matoke. It's such a good. And then we put coconut milk. I love the meal. Rocket. But it always goes bad so quickly. I hate that. I'm not supposed to be drinking this, but actually I'm on a budget. I can't get my usual almond milk right now. So I take this in like tiny, 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 tiny bits. So do. And then topping up dish soap. Potatoes, sweet and the white. And that's my shopping. Yeah, so I'm gonna put everything where it's supposed to be. <laughs> if I tell you, if I tell you now, would you keep on? Loving me If I tell you If I tell you how I feel Would you keep Bringing out the best in me In me Sweet as taboo Behind your back to your face, 
while holding a microphone. We're making fun of you guys, you know? And a common insult I hear about white people that I do not agree with, okay? And I stand up for the Caucasian community on this one, okay? All right? I am a reverse ally. That's what I am, okay? Common insult I hear is people say, oh, you know, white people, white people don't have a culture. White people don't have a culture. And that's not true. about what makes us good or bad. I said that the thing that makes us good or bad is how accountable we are for our actions. And accountability to me is really the key here. So I wanna dive and talk a little bit more about accountability in this video. What is accountability? Even just a man making 60 grand a year. A lot of people think that women going after men making a regular wage and wanting to be provided for by those men is still gold digging. Be for real. So anyway, it's not about finding a rich man. It's about finding a success-minded man. And a lot of the time, they're rich, okay? Develop some nuance, okay? Like, can you be for real? And like I said, as women, it is literally in our nature to find a financially stable and able man. Like, why would we go against our own nature? For what? For the attention and validation of the low, bare minimum, low effort men? <coughs> Thank you. Here's the thing too, Bessie. I want you to develop this level of discernment. Because whenever people attack you or project anything negative onto you, you should... I'm literally screaming. Friends, I'm praying for all of us girls. <laughs> To just kill that illness of dating broke niggas. Kill it. Dead it. <laughs> dead it. I dead it. Dead it. Dead it. No dating broke men. Oh my god. They don't deserve us, sis. Oh my god. They don't deserve us. They do not. Oh my god. 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 Have you heard me? Forget it. Dead it. That illness. <laughs> Apple cider vinegar it. <laughs> Pray for me, because I'm praying for you too. Pray for me though. Hey. Aish, come on. Come on. Ah. No, thank you. Here's the thing too, Bessie. I want you to develop this level of discernment. Because whenever people attack you or project anything negative onto you, you should know that it's all projection. So these below bare mid below effort men, they want to tell women you're a gold digger. But in reality, they're the gold diggers. They tell women, you're going to be old and lonely with your cats and your dogs. And you're going to be yeah, so miserable. I've been told they this. Know they will be lonely and miserable with their cats and their dogs. Do you get it now? Everything is projection. I am so rooting for you, bestie. You need to make all the mental protection you can against these below bare minimum low effort men. Ah! Don't let these men tell you that you are asking for too much. If they call you names, it's because let these men tell you that you are asking for too much. Bare minimum low effort men. Don't let these men tell you that you are asking for too much. If they call you names, it's because they're projecting. Do you get it now? Because at the end of the day, they're the ones who want access to you you're not the ones haggling with them okay they want what you have and they will do anything to get it like i said men are market driven if they don't like what they are getting in the dating market they're going to set their sights higher and haggle, haggle. this isn't the flea market sir it's a, this is not a free market leave me the fuck alone leave me the fuck alone
Oh my God, I'm not the one who in my hey? Jesus, Jesus. Hey, no, to because today yo, these videos, these videos are getting to me in the best way though. Ah, by the way, I need her manifesto and the wizard Liz. I need those these two youtubers in my life when i don't i have noticed my life just i start fumbling i start fumbling i need i need the wizard Liz in my life and i need manifesto i'm so proud of them though for you know doing the work that they needed to do to get to this point of like sharing this message because it's weakness that we are dealing with. I know I have had serious moments of weakness. You know? <laughs> and people, <laughs> ooh, men especially. But let me just say people, in, but men. <laughs> These men are like filthy dogs. These men, they will use your weaknesses against you. On purpose. That's the part that I have just never been able to understand how. But, <laughs> hey, that's what she's saying. Like, girl, it's a lie. <laughs> it's a, a lie. And you think you've gotten it? But wait to turn in with one of these men at a moment where, <laughs> hey, I thought I was doing so well, actually until hmm. hey? Hey. <laughs> ah, hey. that laugh was really scratching an itch somewhere deep in my freaking chest and stomach favorite flowers so beautiful gorgeous red morning walks Too is so good. We did it, baby. Morning walks. He's a champion. <laughs> Have a lovely day.
I really hate swimming in the sun and it's so out right now. I've put on sunscreen but I still prefer not to. that I'm actually queer what am I doing with these men <laughs> I got options <laughs> I have options what am I doing with these men why am I why am I? <sighs> it's the loneliness the loneliness it really confuses me sometimes you guys I can't see straight I really can't that's why you need really good close friends in your life people who can help you up when you're down and weak i know that's what i need because when i'm on my own it really takes time but i'm okay with it i do what i gotta do whenever i get the strength i do take action and uh, yeah we need to take care of ourselves so do your best to take care of yourself the way you need to be taken care of Literally, the exit is right there. Oh my god. Hello, 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 hello. Take it home, home. 
so my many technical difficulties oh my goodness i've had so many technical difficulties why wasn't this on fuck i should have had this on literally i just realized that right now anyway i had technical difficulties my controller guys you know i sold my sb3 and that is the worst mistake I have ever made in my DJ career. Let me just say, I sold my SB3 and that person I even sold it to DM'd me and told me that it got stolen, literally. I, I cried. I actually cried because that SB3 was beautiful and it worked so well. I haven't had this for even a year. Has it been a year? I don't think so. And it already has issues. The sound card is not as good as the SP3 one. As soon as I get cash, I'm getting another SP3 and a bigger controller because... But actually, I'm cool with this one. But later, I'm going to get a bigger one. But I need to replace the SP3 because... And I got it for so cheap when I got it. This is so messed up. Anyway. Yep. So I had fun though, just besides the technical difficulties, I had fun with the setup. I had to move my entire studio. It's in a mess. This is how the rest of the room looks, literally. So it's just that part that's cute. <laughs> the rest of it is a mess and I have to arrange it all again. Oh, anyway, let me do that because I want to record like... A little thing to add at the end of the the mix because the mix was short it was just too many technical difficulties I was like oh my god it's good that it ended so I'm gonna add I'm going to add I need to record like a little podcast bit so yeah let me put my studio back together let me put my studio back together and then do that i also have to make some rice to eat i have leftovers too from last night so yeah. i feel like i was a part of a group and had friends i eventually lost a lot of confidence in myself i know most kids have wow the sickening makeup is crazy it's gonna look like this yeah but it'll take a few hours we're gonna start with your arms now, you're going to have to keep your arms still for the entire session. You need to do anything? You all good? Yeah, I'm all good. You sure? Once they start, you can't move. All right. Uh, one second. I'm good. Okay. Sweet. Hey. Hey.
just finished making dinner this is 
rice i always put turmeric and a little bit of black pepper into my rice i also added um, rosemary and oh yeah actually this is garlic butter rice with rosemary i fry the butter first with the garlic and then i fry the rice in that and then i add the water and boil it and cook it i mean then this is a veggie stew with coconut veggie stew with baby spinach it's just a regular pack of like the veggies the 100 shillings pack of mixed veggies and i added baby spinach and coconut it's really spicy and tasty with a little bit of chili delicious it's 9 30 p.m i'm gonna finish editing this vlog actually so this is actually the night before i'm staying up tonight to finish editing this vlog so i can go up tomorrow morning on friday yeah so people i'm going to end the vlog here thank you so much for watching thank you for spending your time with me subscribe if you haven't subscribed if you're a returning subscriber watching my videos again thank you so much for being here i'm so grateful for you and yeah i really hope you enjoyed this vlog check out my other videos if you haven't comment let me know your thoughts about the vlog comment like share the video subscribe it really helps to for my channel to grow and yeah much love this is Iche signing out bye